wazir, a great wazir um, in Central Asia in I think third century AH, for you know, 10th AD, something like that, a Sahib ibn Abad. And he was a very literary person. And he used to have these majalis, the, the sessions where people would come and recite poetry and uh, you know, and, and, and talk about literature. Uh, and there was um, one man there one day. Oh, I'm sorry, we're going back to the subject of farts. Um, and <laughs> all these people dressed up in their best and talking about poetry, and the man farted. Um, and everyone looked at him, and he said um, he was sitting on a tacht. A, a, it's, what, it's a, quite a rare name for a, a, a seat. Tacht, it's, it's actually fallacy, I think it's not Arabic. So he said that he went red. He went bright red and he said, in the sarir tacht. It's the squeaking of my chair. Uh, and the Sahib ibn Abad said, oh, I thought it was sarir tacht. <laughs> squeaking of your underside. Um, <laughs> there are lots of jokes I could tell you about this, but with ladies present, um, I better not. Um, but is, isn't it taht a bed? I know it's a bed. A, sa a sahib ibn Abad. No, no, I mean taht, the word taht. Yeah, what, is ta what, is, what does taht mean for you? Bed. A bed, yeah. A chair. Well, I think it's anything you can sit or lie on. It's probably know. a divan. Like a divan, yeah. Ah, meaning the ah, okay. But you know, there, 